Hi, welcome to Charlotte's Cooking Show. I'm Charlotte. Today we are making Alfredo sauce. I love Alfredo sauce and we're making it from scratch. It's easy. If you have the ingredients on hand and you should, um, you will love making this uh, recipe. It's great. Kids will love it. It's easy and it's a simple fix when you're short on time for supper. I love Alfredo sauce, but I have to admit, for years I bought those packets of the powder and they're great in a pinch, but I always found that they were just a little bit too high and kind of salt, they were a little too salty. But this recipe is so great. It's creamy, it's fresh, and it uses really, really simple ingredients. So the recipe calls for two cloves of garlic. Normally I would put that through my Pampered Chef uh, you know, garlic press, but today I'm actually going to put it on my little fine grater. And this is kind of like a zester. I'm just gonna run the clove across it and then from the underside, I'm gonna, it's going to create like this beautiful garlic paste for me, which is gonna be delicious in the sauce. So the first thing we're doing is we have our water boiling and we need to add some salt to that water because whenever you cook pasta, you have to make sure that the water is properly seasoned because that great seasoning is gonna to transfer to your pasta. So we're going to throw in a good, healthy, two handfuls of good kosher salt to get that water nice and seasoned. So we're ready to get started. I've got a quarter cup of butter and we're gonna get that um, melted in our frying pan. Our butter is melted. It's really important to melt it slowly and to make sure that it doesn't burn because you don't want a burnt taste. You want it to be creamy and delicious. So now it's time to add our really lovely grated garlic cloves. We're gonna add this right to the butter right now. Butter and garlic smells so good together. Because it was so finely grated, um, it doesn't take any time at all to cook. So just stir it very gently, and then you're ready for your one cup of heavy cream. Ready to put our pasta in. So we've got a nice rolling boil here. You're going to have your fistful of pasta like this. I've got this package. You're just going to drop it in into the center, lift up, and just let it fall all around. And then let the pasta kind of cook and fall into the pot of water. Your next step is the freshly grated Parmesan cheese. And this is where fresh really is best. So I've got about, we need a cup, which is about a good hearty handful of Parmesan cheese. Three ingredients remaining. We need a good healthy kind of pinch of kosher salt to season our Alfredo sauce. Next, a good pinch of freshly ground black pepper. And finally, the next secret ingredient is nutmeg, a quarter of a teaspoon of nutmeg. This gives it a really kind of nutty, delicious flavor, and it really pairs well with that Parmesan cheese. Our sauce is all set. I've got it just on really low heat. Um, it's got a beautiful, nice thick consistency. That cheese is melted in, it's so delicious. Our pasta's almost done. How do you know if your pasta's done? Well, you could read the instructions or you could just whip it at the cabinet. So we've got this pasta, we're gonna bring it over and we're going to put it into our beautiful sauce. All right, this meal came together really, really quickly. Um, if you wanna add chicken breast, cooked chicken breast, or jumbo shrimp, or whatever else you'd like to add into your Alfredo uh, noodles, you, you certainly can. But just on its own, it's really hearty and really delicious. So, let's serve it up, shall we? Take some pasta, take our bowl, and serve like that. We're gonna garnish with some chives and some nice shreds of fresh Parmesan cheese, and of course, some cracked black pepper. Doesn't that look perfect? And of course, you need some wine to go with it too. It's a great meal, it comes together really, really quickly, and I guarantee you, your kids are going to love it. So, bon appetit, Alfredo sauce, enjoy.